Oh no, the computer's on fire. It's okay, it's only a Mac. Hey guys, this uh, lesson is on hackers and crackers. Uh, it's very quick, it's just to give you an overview of what these two terms mean. And before you think of things like hackers and crackers like this, I'm gonna help you understand it in a slightly better way. Let's have a look at the difference between hackers and crackers. So hacker being the slightly better version if that could be a thing, uh, and Cracker being the not-so-better version. Okay, let me explain. So, a hacker. If somebody is a hacker, it means that they are very good at getting into computer systems. And the reason this is, is because they are challenged by code. They like to figure out how things work. They want to get into a system or into a program, an application, and see how does it work? How do they put things together? They look for back doors and then try and see if there's a way to get into a program and figure out how everything was made. So they explore system vulnerabilities. This is why hackers are kind of like in demand in certain businesses because the business will employ a hacker to try and hack their software and see if there's a way to break it in some way and that's where we get our terms white hat and black hat white hat hackers and black hat hackers good and bad okay so the white hat would be someone like a security consultant they would come into a business and the business would then pay them and say okay see if you can access our source code see if you can break break our program so that we know how to fix it and make it better. So that is what hacking is all about. So hacking is more of exploration and trying to figure out how does this work and then breaking it down and putting it back together. That's what a hacker can do. However, the crackers. Okay, so a cracker, basically we are looking at that with someone who has malicious intent, someone who wants to break something. That is their goal, is to crack it, okay, and break it up. They want to modify the source code, break up the system, and then distribute that modified software. Often it could be uh, with a virus attached to it, like a Trojan, for example. It could be anything that could break your computer as well and they love it because you were the sucker and you should not have downloaded that in the first place. But in a nutshell, guys, that is the difference between hackers and crackers. You should aspire to be none of them unless you really, really want to go somewhere uh, in security systems. Maybe look at the hacking side and see what, what you can find out. Lots of courses online actually on how to hack, but it's ethical hacking, okay? Not cracker type hacking, okay? Hope that makes sense.